Welcome back to our Toronto Games. Killer G here. Yeah. Introduce yourself. Yeah, this is Info with Silver Trigger. What's up? And yeah, we're back with The Last of Us 2 Remastered. On PS5. The sequel to the first Last of Us game. So go ahead, Info, so explain your history with this game. Story. Abby's character is trash in this game. The voice actor played Abby is not her fault. Is it the fault of Neil Druckmann? The Lord Bailey is going to be threatened. No. She was doing blood rain though. I like her in blood rain, Lord Bailey. Yeah, but they have more. They have more gameplay to it. Yeah, I saw a cutscene where I was trying to tell a story. Yeah, the, the female characters. I don't like the female characters. They're nowhere near as level as the black. No. Relations hit on nail on the head with the female characters. Oh, Dina, yeah, she is. Oh, I mean, uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. What do you yeah. say, Sheena? <laughs> she, no. Nah, I don't care for that. <laughs> no, no, no. Close she, enough. Yeah, she. Gosh, Not because she's women, but her character was bad. I know. Attack on Titan. <laughs> well, take AOT characters over The Last of Us, but uh, uh, AOT is trash. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I'll take those. <laughs> yeah, I'll take those uh, female characters who were uh, the last. Well, I think I think the gameplay is good. In last of us too. That's the best thing about it. Is the gameplay. Yeah. That's yeah, the only good thing I can say hard. about it. Some of the enemies look decent, like the Rat King and the big bloater, big explosive bloater and type of enemy. The enemy yeah, variety is better, a little better. Result for an infected. 
But the story was convoluted and made no sense. You only had to play as Joel during the start of the game when he was riding on the horse and that was it. No no other Joel sections. I mean, I don't care for Joel. I said anti-Joel. I don't care for Joel. I, 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 I get it, but a lot, a, lot of people, a lot of people like Joel, so... It was kind of a slap in the face for the Joel players, though. You got to play as a Hulk to, to Abby. Superman is overrated. I'll take Superman over Joel. That's a Western character. Yeah. Superman's iconic, though. That's the thing. But Joel's okay, -ish, sure. In, in my opinion, he's alright. He was good enough in the first game. I don't care for the TV show. Alright, that's your opinion, though. But for... I mean, Abby, of course Abby is the worst villain. I mean, a tryhard, of course. Oh, a yeah. That's good at me you are reviewing there. This is, oh, this is where Abby uses the pipe. Okay, I think they made her broken. There's OP. There's Tommy. And there's Joel. Xbox has something. Xbox has their old school games, at least. But probably, where is the new IP? I yeah. mean, yeah, this is a new IP. I mean, yeah, new IP. But I like what Xbox is doing with some of their stuff there. Starfield was big for them. And High Five Rush was one of the jams, sir. High Five Rush was so good that it's on PS5. So the PlayStation fame was actually has something to play. You uh, know, you uh, never, you never took it from Xbox. When they become slowly walking, what the fuck? This is from RE Resident Evil Revelations too. I know. I mean, to be honest, Ellie's the most overrated survival horror female cat. Oh, yeah. I prefer Jill than Valentine. Not because Jill was uh, hot, no, 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 but for uh, character rated, Jill is better. Even a girl for 12 months at Soul is better than Ellie. That indie game that, that, indie that, came, that came out there is way better than Ellie. She has more depth, the character has more depth to her. And if you haven't tried that game, try out Torment the Souls there. On the Xbox or PlayStation there. It's an old school as you know, small horror game. But, yeah, it's a clicker. A cl yeah, it's a click beater. It's a click beat YouTuber. Like what? Drink guy? <laughs> or or one of those, I mean, one of the 
what George felt on the Princess Peach demo. Yeah. Sega Lord X. That's a true Sega fan. So oh, yeah. True Sega YouTube. Uh, Kan Kai. Kan Kaskai. Soy. Soy. Very. Soy boy. Soy guy. Yeah. Young girl. I don't think I drew a cast guy, he's boring. I know we're late at night doing this review, but at my time I don't give a shit. The angels suck shit, that's what I have to say. Sucks more than a ball sack that's full of cheesy poops. With the cheese on it. Oh man, I bet they gotta defend Horizon Zero Dawn Master. Oh yeah. Well, it was, well, it was gonna look like the one from her for, for Ben West there. There's no gameplay variety. Masori doesn't know how many good characters for, for shit. Fucking clicker. That's your ass, zombie fuck. Maybe your girlfriend protects you from that clicker. Yeah. I don't know a, a better a better last one scheme would be down too. At least you have fun just dropping people, dropping zombies. Punch them with your fist is fist of your fist. So that's a better last of two is down too. It's not, not it's a non political crack game is there to have fun. Which coming up I have to review that on too, so which I'll be doing that one pretty soon. Now nah. Now you guys see what you're gonna say infamous, sir. Yeah, go ahead. Man, I don't care for that. Seriously. We're dog shit. But now we're talking about the Abby and the Abby and the Joel scene now is the famous scene of this game. No, like when this game came out, they gave like 10 out of 10s and shit. There's better games out there on the PS, on the PS4 at the time. There was a lot better ones. There were better, better PS4 exclusives. That, we, that you can say and that can argue that are worth it. I think the, the true console had the good one. The good exclusive was the PS3. It was, it was, yeah, they had Sid it was more. But they had gameplay in there too. That's, that, that's why I enjoyed the PS3 and the, the PS2. Being 
Oh yeah. Pilot's jacket fist of the style. Yeah. Where's Pilot's? That's Berserk is overrated, but that uh, pop, that Dark Pilot Fantasy set this was way better. Yeah. Yes. I think the fact that me and you were reviewing this game finally, which is interesting. So I want you to go full rant mode, Infamous. What, the ratings? Or well, just what you, what you were ranked on about this, about this game in general, or what you didn't like. Oh, man. I'll give it 4 out of 10. 4 out of 10? Except the gameplay, of course, it has Yeah, the gameplay. Does the story suck? Does the story is convoluted? It was just Abby. I, I don't. The ending sucked. Was Ellie lo lost her fingers? She couldn't play Joel's guitar. Dina laughed. Tommy laughed. Like the ending was a ending was a shitty ending there. Abby got away. Uh, Abby got away alive with the, with the other, with the with the trans, with the trans kid there that was in the game. That was at that. Uh, that was at that cult, the crazy cult area. Go ahead. I mean the enemy are stereotypes. Yeah. And here you're in a news station too. That's why Western gaming is dead. Western gaming is like they're lazier. Because uh, yeah, they let these uh, stupid users uh, as a developers. I think there's a company behind that's why the games are sucking. You ever heard of Sweet Bee Inc? That that's a that's a SGW written company there. That's why the games have been sucking lately there. Why games why games don't feel the same? There's they're forcing stuff in games now. That and maybe that's why the games are kinda of sucking there. I don't care for that Terry shit. Sucks. But uh I just one thing I one thing I point out there during the sixth and seventh gen, that's when gaming was alive. That was the best type type of gaming was that those times. Even the Super Nintendo, the Genesis were good too, and the N sixty four, the PS one, Dreamcast, all that. Those were the best generations of gaming. Even the NES and the Sega Master System. Gave you games, uh, crap's PS5 games. Yeah, games. Game games are. Uh, yeah. Games games are better. Games games are better. <laughs> At least you get to play. That's uh, the first thing ever. Yeah, peen free. Yeah. And you had Mario, Mario, Mario Kart Double Dash, which was the best Mario Kart of, of all time. It was one that had two player carts in history. Never did that after that. Mario, I mean, Double Dash was better than Mario Kart 8 in terms of, uh, in terms of gameplay wise. Story-wise, you didn't care for it. Abby was just a freaking 
steel ass character. Her character sucks. The story was the one. It's actually the scene where where that guy was doing evil sex with Abby. It's like call like like <laughs> like do we need this did we need an evil sex scene in this game? And she had she, her teeth her tits look like a her tits are all fucked up she got fucked up tits, Abby. Well she got little boy tits. And that's and that's disgusting what I'm just saying what I just said. Her tits don't look that good. The little, like the the, 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 the oddest shaping tits I've ever seen in my life. That's why that's why Abby's that's why Abby's character sucks, sir. Yeah, they said that. Oh yeah, her, that one, they're not freaking goof there. My hands, my hands sore. I lost feeling my hand. And they're trying to cook us with the shotguns, so once again I wanna say thank you for watching. Right, right last minute of this review. We're finding the jackass clickers. And they're like this yeah. We had arms around there. We gotta watch out for the click beaters. Like combine the camera. Alright, so this is Killer G here once again. Thanks for watching. Final thoughts. Alright, if it's you do your intro do your introduction. Yep. If it was still this, uh, this game sucks. Garbage. This game is dog shit. Alright, later.